Hey, what's up, guys? It's Still Vinci. Today I'm back with another video. Today I'm gonna be trying to go for more of a West Coast Larry June type of vibe. Um, he just dropped a new album that's phenomenal. So that's kind of the vibe I've been on today. So yeah, I'm gonna try to make something like that. All right, what's up, guys? So today we're gonna be working in Ableton. Um, I actually kind of started this beat already, but I, it was so fire that I wanted to do it on video. So um, yeah, I basically start out with some drums uh, right here. Let me play them. Pretty simple drums. Um, mm. Yeah, so I just got this kick right here. Um, pretty basic. I got a little snare. Uh, and I got this uh, percussion sound. Yeah, it's like a little like rim shot. To add some bounce. I uh, got an open hat at the end right there. And then I got this little hi-hat loop. Uh, mm, mm, mm. It was actually uh, like it was actually this is what how it sounded originally, but I um half timed it to make it a little bit more like bouncier. You know what I mean? So yeah, all the jumps together, um, I actually put them all into a bus, and I put a, a decapitator on it just to like give it a little bit more like um like distortion and saturation to it, and I put this vitamin uh filter on it, and yeah, so. I'm just gonna start going crazy. I pulled up this synth in Omnisphere. Pretty nice stock sounding pad, but I think this shit is fire. So yeah, I'm gonna start laying down these chords I came up with. Next, I'm gonna add this uh, little synth sound. I believe this is out of a uh, Juno 62. Let's see, this is a uh, yeah, this is just another Juno 60 sound. And I, I feel like a lot of these like West Coast beats like are based off of like vintage synth sounds. Um, yeah. So, uh, yeah, I just think this sound matches the vibe. And I have a melody in my head that I came up with, so I'm going to lay that down. So we got uh, two sounds laid down. Uh, I'm gonna try to find another synth sound out of Omnisphere. And one of the things I love about Omnisphere is that they have a lot of these really cool like vintage synthesizer banks. Um, and all you really gotta do is go over here to um, samples, go to the sample library, go to synthesizers, and yeah, these are all the like synth libraries. You see you got Prophet 5, 
um, Juno, JP8000, Jupiter 8. A lot of really cool sounds. So yeah, I'm, I'm literally just gonna go through some sounds. Even you got D50. I'm just literally gonna go through some sounds and try to play some stuff over it, see if I can come up with anything. I'm actually thinking this bell might be kind of cool, honestly. I'm gonna just like record this. And also let me duplicate this. So we have an eight bar loop. Um, let me delete this shit too. Let me duplicate this more so we actually have a 16 bar loop so we can kind of just like play around more and have like more space to do whatever. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna try laying down this bell. Uh, I'm a, I have RC20 on both of these uh, synth sounds as well to kind of give it a little bit more like reverb and uh, like some texture. So I'm gonna put that same thing on this bell. Yeah, let's get it. Yeah, I don't want to do anything too complex with this bell. I kind of want to just kind of be like a, like something kind of simple. Um, and I want to put like the other synth sounds around it to kind of like make it kind of like call. I want all the sounds to kind of like respond to each other. So it's like cohesive and not like all over the place. But um, yeah, I'm not mad at this bell at all.
right, so I actually switched the bass to like a kind of like a synth bass right here. Just to kind of like give it that more like West Coast feel. But I kind of want to layer it with like a sub 808. Um, so I have one in mind. I think it's in this cooking soul kit I have. Let's see. I just want like a sub 808 kind of like. Let's see. Honestly, this one could be cool. I think what key is this in? I just want this to hit on like the one just to like kind of like fill it in more. Let's see how that sounds. Right, so that's an E. If I put that down by one, or actually, I put it by three. That should hit like right there. And I could have like. Let's see how that sounds. Like the first two, we could have it like. Let's see, the first, the first like two bar, maybe we could have it like the 808, and then it switches into the bass line like. Yeah, I think that's kind of cool. Extend this one out a little bit, like. But what if I do it like that, though? Like, hold on. Yeah, okay. It needs it needs to just be like that. Okay, cool. So now we have like a bass line that we kind of made. So now we can move on to some new sounds in the beat. All right, guys. So for the next sound, I want to try something different. Um, I'm actually be using my synth in this beat, the Korg MS20. Um, so yeah, I set my camera up over here so you guys can see it. Um, yeah, I have like a pretty basic like a uh, sign square type type uh, sound loaded up. But yeah, I can like change the sound for like. Uh, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna start playing around with this and just like laying it down. Um, I'm gonna put a lot of reverb on this though, just so it like kind of like has a little more life to it. Honestly, some delay would be kind of cool as well. takes right there well not a lot of takes i just did like a really long take but i think that right there at the end might be the best thing to use for this let's hear it
All right, guys. So now that we got the synth laid down, uh, I think it's time that we start trying to arrange the beat. So what I did is I made a little intro right here in the beginning. Um, and I want to try to fill it in with maybe some guitar and then some like uh, electric piano keys. So really quick, um, I want to lay down some guitar in the intro at least because I think it might be cool. Um, but I'm gonna lay down this electric piano really quick uh, in Lounge Lizard. So yeah, I'm gonna try this out. See how this sounds. If I do this, if I like play the chords, I hear that. that kind of layering the chords the roads like an octave up i think that sounds kind of sick actually kind of like a one shot like. and then, uh, kind of like that that sounds pretty cool yeah i'm not mad at that at all so that, yeah i want to drag out though so check this out Now I think I'm gonna try to play some guitar on this. Yeah, maybe this little intro part can be like a little like breakdown. It doesn't have to be like the intro. Uh, 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 but for now, where's my guitar? I hope my guitar is tuned, but we're about to find out. guys um i still kind of got like wrap with this be a little bit but i wanted to just get the idea down on the video 
But I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope uh, you guys were able to learn something from this. I kind of was just having fun and kind of freestyle making this beat. But yeah, guys, make sure you guys like, comment, subscribe. Thank you guys so much for watching. Peace.